Hey YouTube, this is Brett Burns with The Prepared Man. I'm out in the woods today and I wanted to talk to you about something I've been seeing here lately. I was watching some YouTube videos from some fellow bushcrafters uh, just the other night and a guy pulled out a Ziploc bag with a logo on it. He said, I'm going to use some fatwood here. And got to thinking, I thought, man, did he buy that? And I thought maybe he just bought it for the video. And then I got to reading on some forums and I realized a lot of people just don't know that fatwood is naturally occurring. So I wanted to shoot a little quick video about just how to find fatwood. I'm on my cell phone, so I know it's a little shaky, so just bear with me. Now, what I've done is I've just marched myself out in the woods, and I've found this fallen pine. Now, this is an old tree. It's been dead a long time. Old timers used to call them finback pines because of these, these fins or these ridges that you see as the wood rots away. And what's making that wood actually stay here is the resin itself. So all I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take my hatchet and chop those fins off, those spikes, and you get those nodules where where the limbs came out and you get some really primo fatwood. So this is fatwood that I've processed today and I'm hoping you can see this in this video. This is excellent fatwood. Yeah, I know some of you guys have purchased it. Look at that, it looks like plastic on the end. See how, that, how just liquid and just filled with resin that is? So that's some great fatwood. So guys, you can get this for free. I really suggest that you get out into the bush and you look these things over before you start buying fatwood. I saw some companies, and I'll go ahead and call them out. Light My Fire, Light My Fire sells pieces of fatwood for $9. One piece of fatwood. It's ridiculous. So get out into the bush, find you a nice finback pine like this one, and, and process some fire starting. This fatwood right here is going to go to a, a buddy of mine, Brian Rogers, who's kind of under the weather, he's been injured here lately, so I'm going to send this over to Brian and let him use this. He's a local boy, so guys, get out there in the bush, find this fat wood, and have a good time. This is Brett Burns, The Prepared Man. Take it easy.